A local family had a scare of their lives this week when at 70 miles an hour, the back axle of their minivan snapped in half. Tonight, they're sharing their story and we're investigating to see if this is happening to other families. Brad Satin has a story. I thought this was it. Derek White was driving about 70 miles an hour Sunday when... Without any warning whatsoever, completely snapped and sent the car into a violent tailspin. The rear axle of his 2001 Ford Windstar broke in half. While the kids were screaming, my wife was screaming. The car spun and nearly flipped, but miraculously never hit anything before coming to a stop on the interstate facing the wrong way. The good Lord was looking over him. Jeff Gazette's sister was in the minivan. He's been a mechanic for 23 years. But you never see a, a broken axle like this. You just never see it. He believes the construction of the axle allowed moisture to get in. And this axle rusted from the inside out. You driving at 70 miles an hour down the road, this would be happening and trying to gain control. Other complaints have been reported to the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration of rear axles on this model broken, snapped in half, and cracked. Ford is not familiar with this case, but a spokesman tells us many factors, including how a vehicle is maintained, can affect performance, that the company continually monitors for problems and has a very structured, time-consuming, and methodical procedure for identifying potential defects. Derek White's car can be fixed. It'll likely cost upwards of $2,000, but the big questions tonight are, why did this happen, and could it happen to someone else? In South St. Paul tonight, Brad Satin, 5 Eyewitness News. Black Friday shoppers know it's great for deals, but it also...